Hi, this is Mariette. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to prepare a spicy Mediterranean dip called Muhammara. It's very easy to make. All you have to do is mix them all together and throw them in the fridge. For this dip you need one and a half cups of breadcrumbs, red chili pepper, this is very hot red chili pepper, you can use mild if you cannot stand very spicy. Also we're going to need half a spoon or more of cumin, salt to taste and walnut, which I break it down with knife like this. I don't put it in the food processor because it becomes powder and it's not good for this dish. You cut it like this with the knife. Sometimes uh, if you leave it leave a bigger pieces that's okay too. So around one cup of walnut. You can make it more or less. One cup of olive oil and two cups or more of cold water. The main taste of this a dip, besides being spicy, is pomegranate molasses, which uh, I use for one and a half cup, around five ounce of it. You can buy this in Mediterranean stores, ethnic stores. Choose the ones that are thick. There are ones that are very thin. I, it's not. It's not good. I prefer the thick one. Choose the one. When you do like this, it should be a little bit thick. First. I put the two cup water on the breadcrumbs. Then we add the red pepper powder. This is five I put. You can always adjust, add more. I think this one will have one more spoon. That's six total spoon of uh, hot red pepper powder and it's dry so I'm adding one more cup of water. As it stands it will thicken. Three quarter teaspoon of common, one teaspoon of red chili pepper, pomegranate molasses, five ounces, This darkens the color, which is good. Half a spoon of salt, approximately one cup of olive oil. Then we add uh, walnut. This is approximately one cup of walnut. You can make it one and a half cup or half cup. It enhances the taste of this dip. This is it. It's as easy as this. And this will really impress your, your guests. It's very tasty. Just wrap it or cover it and throw it in the fridge. It will be tastier next day. This dip is delicious with wedges of pita bread or French bread or any type of bread for that matter. It's very, very spicy. Mm. I'm sure you like it. Please leave comment and don't forget to rate and subscribe.